Was My cum rag is wet. What are you doing? Just grab it so I don't gotta get up again. Oh my goodness. You're like less than like three feet away from it. Yeah, but I'm not dressed from the waist down very nicely. What is that supposed to mean? I don't know. I'm not dressed from the waist down very nice. Are you wearing a diaper? <laughs> no. Hold on. Got to get that out the way. Got to move this. Got to move that. Got to get just that. Got to move the keyboard so I don't fucking get beer on it. I don't even know if the goddamn beer cam is fucking working. You I guess already we're... checked it. Yeah, but I didn't check it with beer in front of it. God damn it. Well, maybe had you not been fucking around. Shut up! I've been watching body cam videos. I want to see, you know, when Chicago burns down, I want to see why it's going to burn down. We all now know I know why. why. Actually, I don't really understand why after watching that video. But who? Who am I? We're not talking about that because that'll get into politics. Anyways, shut your mouth. Here we go. Maybe a little bit more excitement when we're about to hit the camera. I'm excited. I'm clearing my thing. <sighs> you look really excited. I'm really excited. What's up, folks? What's up, Ed? What's up, all you all other alcoholics out there tonight? Big shout out to Jacqueline. Hope you feel better, boo. What happened to Jacqueline? She's got a cold. As long as you ain't got the C, you're good. You ain't got the C. I thought I would be drinking uh, seltzers tonight, but I'm not. So there's going to be some few heartbroken people in chat. What? Because I promised this weekend I'll be drinking seltzers only. I don't think I can do it. I really don't think I can do it. I truly don't think I can. I'm two beers in. Relax. Uh, what are we drinking right now? I have no idea. This is the very first time drinking this bad boy. Hyper hi, hipster beast mode. Hipster? Wait, whoa, wait. Are you serious? Hipster beast mode. Who bought a beer that says that's called hipster? You, clearly. Oh, my God. Well, let's drink this. I probably shouldn't show that on camera because that's disgusting. Folks, I'm not a hipster, just so you know. Uh, I don't endorse a beer like this. I never would. But we're going to drink it because, well, it's got alcohol in it. It's pretty frothy. Da -da. Ooh, look at that. Nice, nice. Beautiful pour. Smells good. Oh, it had something in there. <gasps> Ew. Well, yeah, sometimes the hazy beers have stuff in there. They might have floaties in there. Oh, that's... I don't think that's good. What is it? It's got weird floaties in it. Hold on. What like, kind of... Floaty float... Like, I, oh, I don't know. Well, hazy beers... No, look, put your, put your camera on. The put camera's ca on, woman! Oh, look, can you guys see it? Here, let's get a... Let's get really close. Where the fuck... Where's the camera It's got, at? like, chunks in it. I can't find my own camera. There we go. Focus. Oh, no, where are they at? Over here. Fuck, you can see you see them? I don't see them. All these, these are chunks of yeah, stuff. Yeah, but I think that's normal. I think hazy no. oh. beer is not as is not as filtered. No, can you do an upside down shot? Look at the bottom of the glass. No, we can't do an upside down shot. Just do an upside no, down shot. Not... Try. No, would you sit down? It's uh, it's not. Look at that. Oh, wait a minute. Is that normal? Because that's I... what's coming down. That's what's in the beer. Well, it's not as filtered. So That's what I'm seeing floating around in it. All right. Before we get in the chat, <laughs> folks, hops and yeast. That's what I say because the, the... I've never seen stuff like that. You've That's... never drank a hazy beer that's not as filtered oh, i've never seen stuff like that in you look what you drink you drink fucking white claw of course you're not gonna of see your that beers. shit in there. i've never seen anything like that in your beer google it is it normal to see f i don't uh, have the fucking keyboard in front of me you have a phone in front of you use it woman i say it's normal some people disagree is it normal to normal to make sure you put ipa chunks IPA. In your IPA. It's not really chunks. It's more like, I think they're just hops. And we just, the first thing right there, bam. Small amounts of sediment in beer is natural and an often common occurrence in brewing industry if the beer is not filtered. Oh, that, but that looks nasty. Oh, I wouldn't uh, drink that. Is there a date on it? 
I want to drink that. That looks nasty. Is that the beer from In the Hearts? <laughs> you shut your mouth. No, I don't. I don't see a date. There's a date. On every can. There's not. You could never find the date. Well, neither can you. So what's who's the problem? Well, you got 2020 20 vision. That's the reason no I'm married. There's no dates. Look on the bottom. Yes. That's nasty. Well, if I get sick, then I'm gonna blame someone. I don't. I think that's. Cause remember we had that beer. There was a long time ago we had that beer that actually had hops and it. it had like uh, it had like big old chunks of shit floating in Go it. Go back to your beer cam. Go back I could to. See, you could see it. Go back to your beer cam. Oh my god. This is normal. I don't this isn't normal. Read the can. Maybe it'll t it'll tell you like, hey, fair warning, there's gonna be shit floating in it. Brewed and bottled in Chicago, pipe workers brewery. Oh, it's from pipes, it's probably lead. Uh no, it doesn't. There's a sticker over the thing, so single beer. I mean I've never there that is quite a bit. Hold on. Uh, I'll let people... See, people in chat just want to see me croak. But I think that's normal. That doesn't look... That looks nasty. I know, but I think it's normal. No, that that's fucking nasty. Nope. Oh, my God. I mean, drink it, but I think that's gross. Well, as long as it ain't fucking mold, I'm, I'm going to drink it. Jennifer says, not normal. It's fine. Down that motherfucker. Ed's trying to kill me. Just dead yeast, perfectly normal for unfiltered uh, ale. Uh, Don't drink it, Mark. See, uh, how are we going to start off a show with me <laughs> abusing alcohol? Uh, I should filter out with a, with a coffee filter. Hops and yeast make the world go around. Dump that shit out. Okay, I don't know. I feel like that's normal. Well, taste it. Does it taste okay? It tastes weird. Tastes fine. I got a little sourness to it, but... What if you drink the last swig and it's like... <sighs> All right, I'm grabbing a new beer. <laughs> I can't believe I'm wasting a beer. <laughs> I, I know this that. is normal. This is why I don't do fucking beer videos. Mm -mm. Nope. There shouldn't... I'm sorry. I don't, I don't care. There shouldn't be chunks of stuff floating in your beer. Ugh. Nope. Mm -mm. Nope, nope, nope. I wouldn't drink it. That's gross. That's yucky. That's because you don't drink this kind of beer. But I wouldn't. I don't care what it is. Like that. Remember when me and your brother were into the whole beer, craft beer thing? Yeah. And we bought that beer that had fucking gigantic hops in it, floating in the beer beer bottle. That's, I think, what's going on here. No, that's, this is, first of all, this is a <sighs> random ass can of beer that you don't even know, like. But it's not from, like, a shitty company. How do you know? The pipe works. They're not that, sh they're not a shitty company. Oh, well, I mean, hey, maybe you should have shaken it up first. I don't I know. I thought we just wasted a beer now. God damn you. Well, you could have drank it. I mean, I'm just saying. I thought it was nasty. But everyone's scaring me now. <laughs> oh, man, I don't know what the fuck Got all your is this one of your homosexual ciders? No, this is one of your hot butchers. Oh, okay. Hot butcher. Hop. Hop. Uh, somebody said according to Yelp, it's normal yeast sediment. That's what I I'm don't... saying. It's it. Well, I, then go slurp it back up the drain. I guess. You just waste it. If you want to drink it, drink it. I think it's gross, but if you want to drink it, go ahead. That was a waste of a whole beer. You know the hate I'm gonna get for that? That's alcohol. Abuse. Nobody told you to throw it out. I just said I thought it was nasty. You said, and people in chat said, so don't. No one blame me in the comment section. Once this replay goes up, I had nothing to do with this. I was just doing what people told me to do. Because Mark can't think for himself. Nope, I can't think for myself. Say what's up to everybody while I uh, pour this beer. Hi, Andrew. Back Put in some love black. behind it. Brian. Oh God. Bubbles. Butter Squad. You are horrible. Devin69, Drug Monkey, Ed Barkley, Florida Boy, Gary. That's all I got. God. I don't have the the mouse. It's not a remote it's a mouse. I there said you go. mouse. How about put some enthusiasm behind uh, it? Florida Boy, Gary I said those. Glenn, Gothic Knight, Happy Hippie, Howard, Jennifer. Oh, this. Uh, Johnny the Beard, Kid Bass, Kim C, Michael, Nathan, Neil, 
Rob, Robert Screlly, Ron Jeremy, Rifleman, Six Pack Kid, Troy, Look and Vegan. Look how clear that bitch is. Uh, did I say Howard Pullen? Somebody You are like the here. worst. Oh, shut up. What are we working with here? It's a American Pale Ale. Ooh, nice. Only 5.75. A little low, but that's good. That looks better. Right? I'm saying. This I mean, is, still this got is, stuff floating in this it. This one is filtered. A lot more than the... Well, the maybe fil not filtering stuff is not okay. It's got a little bit more flavor to it than non... Well, it's not, that it's, it's not that it's not filtered. It's not filtered as much. Jesus. Marcus, you, you shut your drink? mouth. Ew, what did you just fling at me? Nothing. Yes, you did. Who saw that hit me? Are you doing drugs? No, you just flung something at me. I don't have anything on my hands. Was it I liquid? Think you did. Yes. Maybe it was just. Oh, it's probably water from when I rinsed the glass out. You gotta lay off the fucking off the crack or something, man. Jesus Christ, you're freaking out. I'm look about to pinch your nipple. Look how normal this beer looks. <laughs> Compared to the other one. This looks completely normal. Don't even start. And I can't find. I can't find forties of hams. I can't find tall cans of hams. We looked at a few places. And hams does not exist only in a 30-pack. And I'll be damned if I'm going to buy a 30-pack of that fucking shit. Ain't no way. Because what happens if it actually tastes good and I end up <laughs> drinking hams? What I told hams? you, Angela, is still there in third round of treatment. What's up, trucking? Jennifer, you're going to have to text me and remind me of what you are talking about. Wow. Angela, it was something that crawled out of the old beer. I bet it was. It's that tastes good. That tastes almost like a normal beer. If the beer's kept constantly cold from the beginning, it doesn't need to be filtered. Yeah, I don't think... I don't I don't remember. Did you try Kenwood? Uh, we've been there a few times. We haven't gone there yet to see about the hams. We're going to do that this weekend, though, uh, Troy. Yeah. We... And if they ain't got <laughs> so, it, we're going to go down to the ghetto. But the, the, the thing is, is though, you go into these... We we're going into, like, little shops or whatever, and you go in and you're looking around... And they're mostly owned by, like, Indian people. Easy, or easy. people of, you know, Middle Eastern descent. And then easy. they're like, you know, what's the matter? Why don't you want anything? And we're like, oh, we're looking for something specific. I told the story. And then you say hams. And they're like, well, we're, we'll order it for you. And I'm like, you don't need to order hams. Like, what? What? Go to the gas station. They should have hams. We... We the, went to two gas stations. We got to go to the ghetto the to Gehetto, get The ghetto, yeah. The ghetto. I don't know too many people in the ghetto drinking hams. That's the problem. I think hams might be a little bit more popular probably in Wisconsin. Mark, why are you telling her easy? You're on a watch list for your comments towards the Indian Brotherhood. There's no <laughs> Indian Brotherhood. Get the fuck out of here. If there's one group of people that do not probably have a gang, it's probably the Indians. You don't hear about the Indian Mafia like growing up in your neighborhood. There, no, I don't want to do a Windows update. Of, what are you, retarded? Windows asks the dumbest shit. It sees that I'm using the computer. I'm currently doing something. It says, hey, would you like to restart right now? Sure, why not? Let's just fuck everything up. All right, instead of playing on your phone. I'm going to Fagan's work. Don't put stuff on me. It's a, it's a hop. It hopped out of my hand. Did you? Oh, we gotta talk about this. We gotta talk about this. Before you tell me what it is, what is it? Oh wait, before you it's talk about, about the this, cicadas. Wait, before you talk about that, I want to ask everybody this question. I don't know who po posted this on Facebook. Obviously, they're friends with me. I don't know who they are. I stared at it for thirty minutes, and I can't understand the joke. Obviously, I showed it to Angela. She didn't have a clue what it meant. So I'm gonna show it to you guys out there, and this is just a screenshot of. What this person posted, uh, Greg, somebody, on Facebook. Can someone explain this joke to me? Because I don't get it. It says, only fans, but it's me smacking your baby daddies with twisted tea. Only cans. I don't, I don't get the joke. I don't, am I too old to get this joke? Does it make sense to anyone? Because it makes no sense to me. Thank you. Right, okay, so I got to get to the part that says it. So there's the cicadas are coming to Illinois this year. I guess there's two kinds of cicadas that are coming out. But the some of the cicadas that are coming out have a fungus. Mm, I love fungus. And so what happens, they're calling it the 
zombie cicada fungus, and that's it's awesome. a sexually transmitted disease. Oh, that's awesome for the cicadas. So the fungus attaches to them, and it turns their like stump, like the their butt, into this like. Um, why? What is happening? Go away. It, it turns the, their butt into this, like, uh, why won't this enlarge? It's not because it's not a picture, it's just embedded. I'm trying into to the... enlarge the screen. Pinch so... and zoom. Pinch and zoom. No, you gotta use one hand. Oh, you're on Facebook. That's why it's no, not it's doing. not Facebook. Anyway, so it turns their butts into this here, yellow, here. this, this weird stump. Beer cam. Okay. Beer can. There we go. Ooh, that looks nice. So their genitalia falls off. The male genitalia falls off. and But it makes them hypersexualized. So they want to like fuck and fuck and fuck, but they can't because they don't have genitalia. Like the, ma the males. They don't no longer have their little penises. So what happens then? So even though they are males, they start acting like females to get the other males to come and mate with them. Oh my God! To spread gay, it, gay yes, cicadas? yes. It's a whole article. So it's not just the world actually cutting their penises off. Now we got <laughs> bugs cutting their penises off. Holy no, it's shit. the fungus that makes it fall off. That's awesome. They have a fungus. So they were so in this in this article, they're saying don't kill the cicadas and don't eat them. Who the fuck eats them? I don't know, but they're saying to take a picture of it so that you can post it so that the the bug people can keep following them. Uh-oh, here we go. Hippie's getting fucking deep tonight. Dump the truck gave you $3. It's a dry hopped beer they hop them after brewing. Real craft beer they use yeast and sugar to carbonate the beer. Then it settles in the bottom, so do a slow pour if you're scared. I would have drank it, Hippie. Andrew, but can we get a daily poop report? I pooped. I'm going to blame people in chat, uh... That was a waste of a beer right there. Is this there. a form of bug, bug population control? I don't know. They were talking about it on the news. So I, I looked it up, and it's it's like a legit thing. They didn't say, like, all of them have it. It's a small population, so they don't think it's going to spread that badly. Dude, who the fuck looks at the bug that closely to notice his <laughs> penis has fungus on it? Well, no, it's but the, the back of the cicada has, like, this big, chunky, white, chalky back end of it. So that's probably why. Oh, and I did want to give a shout-out to somebody today. Uh, shout-out to Mr. Ginger. I guess when you make a lot of money, you shop at really good grocery stores. Our stores don't have meat like this. Make sure his phone number's not shown. But apparently, uh, you can buy this <gasps> at your local deli when you have money. Do you see what that is? Is that a pig ass? Is that what that With is? something going into it? I don't know. But the fact that it's for sale, like you can't buy that at Jewel. <laughs> if I could buy that at Jewel, I, I don't That's think I'd be married. Photoshopped, I bet. No, that looks pretty real. So shout out to Ginger. Uh, he... So I want to see that on his. He should have bought it. No, oh, I guarantee he bought it. Because I, I want to see it on his, on his like. You're not going to see it on his grill. Counter. You're not going to see like, it. On his... You'll see I don't want to see it like that because that I've seen I've seen Photoshop photos like that. Is that an eighteen six fifty that is used? Wait, oh yeah, it, yeah, I did say eighteen six fifty bubbles. You are watching a video. That is, we're not going to make this a vape show, but we can if we want to. Uh, that is, you know, uh, an eighteen six fifty. Inside, I I didn't pull the battery out. I guess in the video, but yeah. Now what's neat about this is that you could charge it from the actual thing. That is pretty genius right there. There's another mod that should have had that feature that didn't have it, but uh, maybe they can steal the idea. Not going to say who. Thank you. Merry Christmas. I split my lip today. Split your lip, came home late, and that's all adding up now. I called you every step of the way of me coming home complaining about it. And you interrupted my Mario Kart game, by the way. I lost so many points. I had the wor It took me almost two hours to get home today. That's what they all say. Did you do the fake and drop test? Uh, not on this. I probably wouldn't do the fake and drop test because I don't think it's going to last. Aluminum doesn't do too well when you drop it. Uh. Any recommendations on a good pod device? 
can't go wrong, Jennifer, with the uh, Caliburn. God damn it. Which one is it with the screen? Actually, fuck the Caliburn. Uh, go with the Pure Max, Jennifer. You won't. There, there ain't no way you'll be disappointed. Get the Pure Max. You can get it from uh, Brad's. If you don't got Brad's Facebook, just email me and I'll send you his Facebook link. Or you could just get it from our website. Caliburn G. There you go. Thank you. Uh, so Jason said, let's see if Mark likes basketball. Who played number 22 for Iowa women's basketball? Oh, that's that, that, is that the girl that they've been talking about? Caitlin something? I thought Caitlin Jenner was a... Not Caitlin Jenner. Oh. It's Caitlin something, right? Another dude playing women's no, basketball? No, she, she like is like the next, she's like the next Jordan. Like she's oh, like... She? Was yeah. she born with a vagina or no? No, yeah, she's a girl. Oh, damn, nice. Sweet. Is Shout that her name, Caitlin? Do Sh I know more than he does about sports? Shout out to her. <laughs> Shout I just watch body cam footage and uh, homeless videos all day on YouTube. Caliburn G3. Thank you, Kid Bass. Caliburn G3 or the Pure Max? In my opinion, Pure Max, I like it a little bit better. I haven't had the Caliburn G in a while, but I do like the fact that it has a round mouthpiece, 510 drip tip. Uh, and then Gary responded to that comment and said... A lot uh, easier to fill, too. $50 says he has no clue nor gives zero fucks. So, Gary, um, somebody owes you 50 bucks. <laughs> Gary, Gary, Hillbilly Gary? Gary and Alexis Bog... Bog oh, that's not Hillbilly Gary. You know Hillbilly... Mark, do you ever read your text? Yes, I don't reply to him, though, Bachelor. He doesn't reply to mine, either. <clears throat> um, <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce this. Ab... Abdul Aziz Abdul Jabbar says, "Can you do a RDL with Pure Max Pod system?" Yes, that's all I actually do is restricted direct lung with the, the Pure Max. It doesn't do mouth to lung that well. You could do mouth to lung, but it's kind of a little on the loose side. It's more restricted direct lung, I think. What's but RDL you, mean? But restricted direct lung. But they say if you get the higher resistance uh, pods, the airflow's tighter. So if you want a tighter MTL vape. Go with the higher resistance, but the 0.6 is perfect for RDL. Like, absolutely perfect. I'm eating Korean kimchi. I would love... What the fuck is kimchi? <clears throat> uh, it's like a... It's a, a cabbage with, like... LGBT. It's, it's like hot cabbage. Like, it's cabbage, but it's hot. Is it's it all cabbage spicy. hot? You cook it. It makes it hot. It's spicy. Ooh. It's diarrhea. It looks happen. really good. I would like, like... Fresh homemade kimchi. Wait, what's LGBT? Is that like a new... I thought it was LBG... Wait. LTGB? Fermented. There you go. Whatever. Spicy. It's Does spicy. it matter what what uh, order the letters are in? I don't... Happy you're being... You're being... I'm offended right now by you. I saw somebody's license plate <clears throat> today, and it said bike, B-I-K-E, L-S-D. So he bikes on, L on Lakeshore Drive. Or does he bike on LSD? Uh, I don't think you can ride a bike on LSD. <laughs> I highly doubt you could do that. Never done it, but I could assume you can't do... <laughs> you never know. You probably can't do much on LSD. Kimchi is a sound the farts make. <laughs> my, my farts make more of a sound of like a wet sandwich bag being... Yeah, so is my coworker. Uh, Dylan said, any pickle juice on the menu, Mark? Nope, I still got... Uh, Three in there, and they're just sitting in there, collect or two in there, and they're just staying cold. Uh, <clears throat> Gary Cole said, no question, just hello, Mark, Angela, and Roger. Also, good evening to all the bitches in chat. Woohoo, bitches! Wait a second, what hold up, on. What up, bitches? Six Pack Kid says, Apple sucks because he's locked out of his laptop for 30 days. Customer service sucks. Wait a minute, Six Pack Kid. First of all, customer service with Apple is probably the best you'll ever get. Why are you locked out? Did you forget your password? Because then that's your fault. And yeah, exactly. Six pack kid. And I love you, but if you forgot your password, that's your fault. You yeah, can't and they blame tell Apple. you that too, because his mom did the same thing. She couldn't get into her phone. She forgot what the passcode was. We took it there, and they're like, "It's set up so that we can't get into it because it's your fucking passcode. <laughs> like you should know it." And six pack kid, the only reason you need a passcode on your laptop is if you're doing something <clears throat> bad. So obviously you're watching porn. I refuse to call LSD DuSable. Oh yeah, I've heard people say that. And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? It's LSD. If you're watching black market snuff porn, 
six pack. A password's not gonna. It's not gonna stop the FBI from raiding your hard drive. Just so you know. After my question gets read, it's nice knowing y'all. Oh, Vic and Bachelor, shut up! It's not like you're going nowhere. Where does question get read at? I haven't read it yet. He doesn't even read. He doesn't put questions. If anyone loves Apple, it's Chuck. Chuck's a huge Apple uh, supporter. Johnny, are you guys back yet? Are you still? Yeah, they've in been Puerto back Rico? Tuesday. Oh, I didn't know. How did I didn't know? Oh, shit. You they ain't staying out in Puerto Rico for two weeks. What are you nuts? Oh, I don't know. He would make it back after two weeks. <clears throat> Galax and uh, <laughs> Galax. That's your new name. Gary and Alexis said, "Hey, Mark and Angela. Mark, do you take an afternoon nap on Fridays to get rested for your all nighters? Do I take an afternoon nap every day he, of the week? Right. He just lays on the couch now because he's got nothing to do. I told him he needs to, we need to get a. a well, now I have. Now. Like all of a sudden, like this, all these companies out of nowhere just said started sending shit. So now next week's gonna be all." And that device that uh, Twisted... Six Pack said, I can get onto my laptop, but can't sign into my Apple ID. Fuck Apple. That's because you forgot your password. It's not the right password, sir. Because you probably attempted the wrong password too many times. Okay, I thought Again, you had... not Apple's fault. Your fault. Apple's way better than uh, PC, Six Pack. Don't <clears throat> Did Mark get cut off tonight? Sorry, uh, wait. Cut off? From what? I'm always cut off. Oh, my beer's not in the shot. Sorry. Look how, oh, no, it's right look how woke that beer is. It's so oh, normal Oh, you're late. Looking. So you might want to watch the beginning when he had a beer with like weird floaters in it. It wasn't weird floaters. You guys made it seem like it was weird floaters. It was completely normal. Did you get the Lego disposable set yet? It's supposed to be here Monday. And the oh, the next disposable, I didn't watch Twisted's video, but ST sent me a link. It's a disposable that actually has video games on it. Pac-Man, Tetris... Oh, and some other one. Hell no. The fact that it's a disposable... Like, uh, not the fact that it has games on it is more fucking mind-blowing. Oh, I hear him snoring? Shh. He's a fucking... Se- Shh, wait. We're not going to listen to him wait, fucking well, snoring. Wait, will you give them a chance to hear him? Can you guys hear him? <laughs> Stick a microphone in his fucking mouth. Don't tempt me. I would bring his ass right over here and put that microphone but it's not, in his face. I guess it's bad that it has games on it, but on top of it, you throw it. You throw it in the garbage. At the at once it's once it's got like it makes no sense. Like why not just make it a pod system? If you're gonna put games on it, what's up, Brett? What's up, Billy Lee? If you're gonna if you're gonna the put games on it, on happy hippie. And I'm against. It's right there. I'm totally against it, but. If you're gonna put games on it, it's at least on. make it a disposable. Oh, it's not. It's not pulsating. That's the problem. It's oh, colors. it's on. Yeah, yeah it's, it's on. It's on white at the moment, and it's not a racist color, by the way. It's just it's just, uh, on white. It's absurd to have games on it, but it's even more insane to make it a disposable. It's like, all right, well, I'm done with my Game Boy. Let me throw it in the garbage. Right, I can't. These Chinese people are just getting ridiculous. They're getting pretty <clears throat> Paul Ketchin has two comments. One, first There's one. There's man right there. Says, hey, Fagan, how's your new flesh like compared to an angry woman? Couldn't tell you. Don't have one. And you don't have an angry woman or a fleshlight? Neither. Actually, I have an angry woman and not a <laughs> fleshlight. Thank you. He also says, Mark Fagan, I actually have a hardware question. Uh-oh. What is your thoughts on Mike Vape's prediction that 2024 is the year of return of the rebuildables? And then he says, as a friend and fan, I would love to see a bulk V2 hit the market. I can think of a few upgrades myself <laughs> that would be substantial enough for a V2. And then there's a couple comments under that. Uh, there's no company that's dumb enough to work with me, A. B. Every company that's worked with him has gone true actually every company that has worked with me has gone under so that's probably a good sign that you'll never see a bulk too <laughs> but yeah i mean mike might be right because there's i mean a ton of shit coming out that's rebuildable I, uh, the whole burrow thing i don't know i'm curious to see what happens with this thing like i love to see how they're going to turn this into a squonk mod because that's going to be shut up and stop <laughs> snoring jesus christ you guys should just so I've been trying to give him a bath every other week <clears throat> just because his skin gets so dry and he gets flakes and whatever. So today when I brought him home, 
he jumped up on the couch right away and I was like, okay, Bubs, we gotta go upstairs. And he literally like hid his head under his paws. He so did not want to take a bath. He hates taking baths. He hates the water. Whereas like Haley loved the water. When we put the pool outside, she loved it. Him, when we put the pool outside, we have to yell at him to go in it. Like, you need to go cool off. Like, go in your pool. And he'll just stare at you while he walks into it, sits down, gets up, and walks out like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm cooled off. I've seen your comment about Geek Vape, and this is the, I'll show you the message I sent them. Because I get butthurt when companies... Check this out. <laughs> Here's the message I sent Geek Vape. And you guys are gonna be like, "Wow, you're a, you're a bitch." <laughs> I said this to them, I think Thursday, and it says, "Did you guys forget about me? <laughs> no, Weenex, Mini Q, Tsunami, Reborn, or Legend Three? And then I made a little sad face. <laughs> they haven't responded. Well, yeah, because it's China. Because they're off. Oh. Their Sunday is our or our Sunday is their Monday." They'll come back with but like it's Friday. And you okay, sent, but it said, our you said, Thursday is their Friday, so when I messaged them, they were already done for the day. Oh, they don't work. Okay, never mind. They work Friday, but but they don't work Saturday and Sunday. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> their Friday is our Christmas. Merry Christmas. Uh, Billy and Pitt says IPA drinkers try to convince you it tastes good, and there's a it's a photo. It, it does taste good. Hit the third button. I'm tired of hitting the fucking button. Jesus, have mercy. Who's that fucking... Who's that woke son of a bitch? <laughs> that looks like Will Smith. <laughs> Will Smith ain't drinking no goddamn beer. He's drinking moonshine. Do we want to talk about the death? The death of who? Oh, OJ. I didn't even know he died, to be honest with I you. I texted you and told you. It That's... was all over. Now that everybody's talking about it. It's so weird though. Like you hear about everyone dying, but I didn't he hear nothing about OJ. Cancer. Oh, nice! Now lay it in there, dude. The internet has no chill. The memes yeah, are hilarious. I can't. Now they're finally together. Like all the yeah, I've seen all that. Well, usually, <laughs> like the minute someone dies, it's plastered <gasps> all over YouTube. I didn't see shit about him dying. Not a goddamn thing. I heard more about P Diddy and. The dude that got shot up in Chicago for shooting cops than anything else. There was things saying, like, when he's at the pearly gates and Nicole's waiting for him. <laughs> like, <laughs> we got, we have, need to have a conversation, motherfucker. Thank you, Daniel D. The D stands for delicious. Chuck's like, or not Chuck. Uh, I can't even remember names now. <laughs> I think we learned that only hippers, hipsters drink IP. Uh, sorry, Vince, your ma. Those bruises that were on your body, those are not hipster bruises. <laughs> those are man bruises. Uh, Joe Roberts says, Hi, bitches. Question, when you were little, what was your favorite cartoon character and why? Angela, what's your favorite flavor of White Claw? My favorite cartoon... Look, okay, so I had a couple. I was a big Ghostbusters kid i was a big ninja turtles kid oh, um inspector gadget i was big on that i love gem um the, the snorks gem? snorkels or the snorks do you remember that the snorks. yeah weren't they, they part of the little... smurfs though no 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 they were underwater and they had oh. like little things on their head i was smurfs wow, so are... i was all those were my things i even had a turtle named Raphael. i was a big ninja turtles ghostbusters girl uh, my favorite White Claw flavor is... Um, watermelon. Watermelon. But I also really like tangerine, too. <clears throat> but they don't make that as a uh, solo pack. The best cartoon char character, bottom line, is, without a doubt... I was also a He-Man fan. Listen, Lionel. <laughs> Lionel from fucking whatchamacallit. Thundercats. He's a Thundercats fan. That motherfucker can pull a, out a sword and call all his bitches, and he'll start running, and he'll <clears throat> save his ass. I was a huge He-Man fan. I love the He-Man movie. I watch it all the time still. He-Man's gay He-Man was my jam. 
My dick got, I think it was the first hard on I got was when fucking Lionel pulled out his sword and said, thunder, thunder. I'm like, holy shit, my dick's growing. <laughs> and when that shit shot in the air and all them motherfuckers start running, I'm like, yep, that's it. I'm sold. I'll fuck every, every last one of them. Have Even... you tried White Claw Surf, Angela? Is that the... Mark bought me one. It was a lime. I wasn't, I didn't like it too much. Fox could smash no, it there's the, too. There's a new one he's talking about. It's a... The Surf? Uh, is it the the iced tea one? I think I haven't tried the no. I just stick to the normals. Or the one that's got tequila in it or some shit. I am horny for Thundercats. Did I? You, you <clears throat> can dress up as fucking cheetah and I'll sodomize the whole room. How do you not like? Here goes asshole head dropping fat ones. Thank you, Ed. You son of a bitch. Asshole head gave you three dollars. Send me one of those beers with that shit floating in it. It'll drink it, you big pussy. Well, luckily I only bought one of those beers. Hold on, let me show Ed his box. He probably doesn't think I'm shipping his beer out. I gotta prove to him I am. I ought to kick your goddamn ass, you fat, funky bitch. You need to get up off your fat ass and lose some of that goddamn weight. Raw Chuck gave you $10. I just want to say that I've been a fan of yours for years now. Also, no grumpy old soldiers this coming Wednesday. So when Chuck? I was little... Who was that, Chuck? I think so. You don't even look at the fucking screen. I don't remember. There's not beer in this box, just so everyone knows. I would never ship beer through the post office, but never. Um, yeah, I think it's. I think we're gonna. We're gonna. Yeah, we're. This is right here. Yep. <laughs> we're not, this is going out tomorrow morning, Ed. By the way. Um, when I was little, my dad was still in my life. Oh um, my god! Here we go, with Daddy. Issues. No, no, no. So I, but I was a, I was a big daddy's girl. So my dad loved horror movies and all that kind of stuff. So I was very big into, I was a, very much a tomboy. So I loved all the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and all that kind of stuff. I, my favorite, one of my favorite movies was Predator. And I used to get in trouble because I, my favorite line was when Arnold Schwarzenegger's talking to the one dude and he's like, what's with this fucking tie business? So as soon as that was coming up, I'd get ready and my parents, both my mom and dad would be like, Angela, don't say it. Don't even do it. And I'd be like, what's with this fucking tie business? Like it was my favorite line. So I was a very big, like, I, I loved all that stuff. I used to like feeling up black chicks in the bushes behind the church. That was my big thing when I was a kid. <laughs> got really quiet why they had to be black girls i don't know just because black girls were pretty popular in my area like even as like a, a five-year-old i was watching like the all the arnold schwarzenegger movies steven seagal movies steven seagal my dad i'm pretty sure is like a huge like he what's up gary idolizes steven seagal so i loved all those movies uh, as have well. you not seen my back wall i think mm -hmm. my father is steven seagal no it, well I think my dad thinks he might be Steven Seagal, no, like after that. that conversation I've had with, after the conversation I had with him. And don't get me started like, on dolphin pussy. Please don't get me started on that. <clears throat> I smoked was, whatever that weed is I got, mm -hmm. I took one, I smoked it, one, just took one hit off of it. Oh yeah, thank you guys for telling him to smoke weed because then he came up to the bed at three o'clock in the morning wanting stuff. And I had to go to work the next day. I was pissed. You could blame them because I didn't want to smoke. All it. of you guys. I didn't want to fuck smoke. Fuck you it. all. Because I three in the morning, really? I got two hours to get up and then I he's wanting stuff. I was mad. I told him like I don't want to smoke. And they said, smoke it. I'm like, I don't want to smoke. And they said, smoke it. And I'm like, alright, I'm gonna smoke it. Don't blame me if something happens. No, of course not. It's everybody else's fault but yours. It That's is. I didn't put take... the I didn't put the pipe to my mouth. Yes, you did. No, they did. These fucking, they're enablers. They enabled <laughs> Angela me. Angela liked Predator so much she married one. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I, that was one of my favorite movies. I watched it uh, so many times. I I'm probably on a list. Have, yeah. Angela, Angela smoke sm a joint. She don't smoke uh, weed no more like she used to. She yeah, smoked weed 24 hours a day. I did. Seven days a week. He would, he didn't like it at all. Yeah, I was like, you smoke too much weed. That's how I got pregnant. Yep. <laughs> Wait till she's asleep. I was asleep. Yeah, she was asleep. And he came over and all of a sudden I get this. This is all I got. That's usually my sign of like, this hey. This is what I got. I'm awake. That's what I got. What do you mean you write your letter? Little, I don't know. How about a little like. <laughs> That's too much work. 
I was like, ugh, I don't if I don't do it, he's going to be like, oh my god, she doesn't love me. <laughs> no, if you didn't do it, I'd just keep doing it all night long until it annoyed you. <laughs> and then, eventually and then I'd go it. to work and you wouldn't talk to me all day. Well, that's what you got to do when you're married. You got to do things that you don't want to do. <laughs> Read a question or do something. Yeah, so remember that, remember that statement. <clears throat> because on the 18th, we're going to the mall, and I'm getting a lobster roll from the cart. Oh, you want to eat from a you want to eat lobster from a truck? By yep. all means, be my guest because you're gonna get sick as dog shit. <laughs> uh, last question is from Chuck. Can you tell me what time the show what time the shows come on this week one more time? Also, grumpy old soldiers will not have to show. This Wednesday. We Why is there no show? show this Wednesday. Why is there no show, Chuck? I don't want to hear any excuses. <clears throat> there should be a show regardless. Don't give Good me. Your mom says, Angela, you should talk to my wife. She says, fuck off, and that's it. I try to, but then he gets butt hurt. If my wife told me to fuck off <laughs> when I started, I don't know, whatever. I mean, I, you know what? I, I just do it. You know what? Just to shut me up. If all I got to do is blow you for twenty minutes, then fine. Twenty fuck minutes. It. It, that's how long it takes half the time. What? It, that's how long it felt. <laughs> uh, your timing is way off. My blowjobs are more like two minutes. No, it, well, it felt like 20 minutes, that's for sure. Fuck you. My jaw hurts, motherfucker. I got TMJ. Well, start doing heroin then. Jesus it, Christ. That shit hurts. It doesn't feel good to me anymore. 20 minutes. I don't about it felt like 20 minutes. I'm not Michael Whitehair, all right? Don't take me 20 minutes. Jesus Christ. <laughs> 20 goddamn minutes. <laughs> That's what it felt like. My jaw hurts, okay? Well, if I had to eat a pussy for 20 minutes, I'd probably fall asleep. Like so You I... have to eat my pussy for hours because it takes me a while. Well. <laughs> Man, read a question. Jesus They're Christ. Done. <laughs> you fucking, what, 11 questions today? You guys are <clears throat> fucking sons of bitches. <laughs> it don't take 20 minutes. It takes like two. Her timing is way off. Trust me I, on this it one. It felt like 20 minutes. Yeah, to her, it probably felt like hell. Also, but... because it was like 3 in the morning and I was pissed. Do mm. you want me to come? Fucking yeah! I should have gotten... <laughs> That's a guy saying, uh, you know what? <laughs> women are women are so retarded. I swear to God, they're retarded. What do you want me to say? No, don't come yet. <laughs> no. no. I hate women. What am I supposed to say when you say that? Just shut your mouth! <laughs> How do we do this show? I don't even want to do this show anymore. I do not want to do it. Oh, Angel doesn't keep his hat on. <laughs> he puts his little, his ding ding through his underwear. He doesn't even take his underwear off. He just puts it through the hole. Well, I usually, <laughs> when I when I pull it through the hole, it means I didn't take a shower that day. So I'm being considerate. Smoke another one, Smokey. <laughs> That usually means I'm being considerate. <laughs> now, when I take my underwear off and I spread my butt cheeks, that means I took a shower that day and I'm all in. Like, lick everything. That's what it means. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, what's wrong with you, man? I my... <laughs> You've been coughing like that for six months. You better go get a fucking x-ray. I think it's my allergies because my throat is so itchy. <clears throat> I think there's something growing in the house because my throat's been itchy, too. We might have some kind of weird... Uh, I don't know. There's something growing in the house. I think. Yeah. So no, that night he just pop he just popped it through his underwear hole. I do that on uh, occasion. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next time I won't be bothered. I'll just take it all off and you just smell the whole day that I've been sitting on it. Uh, Try to be nice, and they don't appreciate. It. <laughs> it's a problem with women. They don't appreciate when men are nice. They don't appreciate. It. Thank you, Brian, for that donation. You son of a bitch. At least turn your hat around. <laughs> I don't wear a head to bed, you fucking, you drunk bastard. <laughs> Angel, have you ever watched Trilogy of Terror? No. Where, what's it on, Happy Hippie? That's Brett. <sighs> no, it was Happy Hippie up oh. there, fuckface. I've noticed you're getting more views on Friday and Mondays the more you drink. You notice that, two bubbles? <laughs> The longer the stream, the more alcohol, the more views. Like, it just, it's an indication that people want to see me, like, die on camera. But the fucked up thing is, <clears throat> on a normal day, Monday through Sunday, 
I sleep like shit. Like I don't sleep well. I'm I toss and turn. I see the clock every hour. <clears throat> But when he doesn't come to bed, I sleep even worse than when he... What is happening? Than when he does come to bed. What is this? So it's this, like... This one of your beers? No, it's yours. It's a uh, Storm Along Unfiltered. Oh, here we go. Another. Oh, no, this is mine. Hard Cider. Get rid of that. <clears throat> what is happening? What? You can't understand what's happening? No, this. What is this? Oh, it just... Oh, there we go. Okay. You're slow. <clears throat> That's the same one I just had, right? This one's actually pretty good. What? This one? All right? That yeah. is the same one. Mm -hmm. This is actually really good. And I've told him, too, like... <laughs> Brian Ferguson donated $2. <laughs> At least turn your hat around. Once again, Brian, I don't wear a hat to bed. Thank you. No, but, like, I sleep like shit on a normal basis. <clears throat> but when he doesn't come to bed until, like, 6 in the morning... I sleep even worse, and it's such a dichotomy. Like, so she bitches when I come to bed, and she bitches when I don't come to bed. You right. can't win, of course. But then I'm like, oh my god, he's gonna come to bed at four in the morning and then want to do stuff, but I gotta get up for work. <laughs> like, I don't care on Friday or I don't care no, on the weekend. I just come to I bed smoke. at any time, and we can do whatever you want to do. But when he comes to bed at like three in the morning, I'm like during the week when I gotta get up for work, then I'm pissed because I don't sleep well anyway. You interfere with the beer pour, please. <clears throat> Um, it's usually just when I smoke weed is when I come to bed wanting something. When I'm, when I, if I'm drunk, I just don't bother because I'm so fucked up. I'm like, you know what? I don't even care. Lock the door, Angela. If I locked the bedroom door, I'll he would bust it down. Yeah, I'll kick he it He does in. not do well with locked doors. I'll kick that shit right <sighs> in. We had a fight, like, we had a fight one time years and years and years of years ago. You told ago. a story like 90 times. No, I've never told this story. About me pulling the door in backwards? No, that was when you took a Xanax. Oh, good old Xanax. <laughs> but we were having... It was one of our drunken nights years and years ago. We were having a fight, so I went in the bedroom and I locked the door. And he was like, if you don't open this door, I will bust it the fuck down. He does not do well with locked doors. <clears throat> I would never... Like, no. Sleeping sex is rape. Glenn, that's how I get laid, usually. <laughs> It's not sleep. I, he doesn't have sex with me while I'm asleep, but he'll come to bed and be just be like this. Yeah, usually a titty rub is like an indication. God forbid he puts a titty in his mouth. No, it's just this. Uh, these women, mm. they want too much. But then he wants a titty in his mouth in the morning when I got to go to work. All right. Anyone in <laughs> chat, anyone in chat that has a girlfriend or a wife, tell me this is wrong, and I would love to know the medical explanation. Rifle man, if you're here, I know you're here. I need an explanation. Why are women's tits bigger and fuller when they first wake up? It is a fact. And if you don't believe me, if you got a girlfriend or a wife, grab her titties when she first wakes up and tell me her titties are not bigger Fine. in the morning. But don't do that when I gotta go to work in like twenty minutes. I'm just I gotta saying, leave for the house. Like, that's let's why I always do that in the morning on a Saturday. That's why I always like the titty grab in the morning because the titties are like gigantic in the morning. I don't Which understand is fine, why. But do it when I don't have to go to work. Like, but I want to know the reason why they're bigger in the morning. Fluid retention. Is that what it is, Rifle Man? Well, your titties are collecting fluid in the morning. <laughs> but titties are ultra plump in the morning. I don't know why they're ultra plump in the morning. I have noticed. I'll go to the bathroom and I'll get up and I'm wearing normally like a Dago T with no bra. And I'm like, look at these bad boys right here. And then throughout the day, they just start <laughs> shrinking. <clears throat> This beer is really... I got to buy more of this beer. It's really good. <laughs> Fucking alcoholics. Because they're filled with silicone. I, no, that's not the it case. It says semen, stupid. Why don't you try reading? Look right below that comment, you dumb bastard. Because they're filled with silicone. I don't have silicone. I wish I did. Get the tape measure out and do a kitty review. <laughs> <laughs> I think Ron Jeremy's smoking meth tonight. We should. We should measure them. Like round size in the night before I go to bed, and then round. No, weigh them. Not measure them. Weigh them. Weigh them. <clears throat> <clears throat> Mark milk and a titty. Been doing it that long since birth. Oh, today is National Only Child's Day. So any only children watching, happy Only Child's Day. Did you see my text? Yes. Happy Only Child's no, Day. No, no, no. Oh, about her seeing my yeah, blowjob so comment. Yeah, so I was. Like, I texted you that, and you hadn't responded to any of my other text messages, so I was like, oh, he's probably doing something. 
So we started. I show. I, we started watching this video, and your text popped up right when we were watching the video, and she was just like, "Oh." <laughs> Really? There's an only child's day? Like, everyone needs there's, a day now? There's national everything days. There's donut days, cookie day, like, everything day. Is there, like, retard day? Probably, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like, was... yesterday was national siblings day. Oh, ST's in chat. Look out. He's an only child. Well, hey. happy only child's day, ST. Woo-hoo, woo-hoo. We're all only childs here in chat tonight. I thought it was National Titty Day. They never <sighs> announced National Titty Day. I bet it's a thing, but they never announced That's it. That's the, what is that one day? What's that one day where they say, uh, what is it called? <gasps> That's Mother's Day. No, it's there's a t- there is a Titty Day. What's titty, the day called? Titty Tuesday. No, it's... <clears throat> Angela, did Mark have better moves when he first got together? Here we go. I was skinnier, no. so of course I had better moves. No. It was the same thing. Just this. Fuck your mama, bitch. <laughs> Everybody's got their signatures. Everyone's got their signature. That happens to be my signature. <laughs> if I grab a titty in the middle of the night, then that usually means, hey, steak and BJ day. I heard about that day. That's eight, that's March 14th, and I learned that from the my one doctor. And that's I told a, him, I was like, well, that sucks because I gave up meat for Lent. <laughs> oh, that was the joke that you didn't understand that he said? No, no, no. That wasn't a joke. No. <clears throat> he told me a joke because... That's a sexual harassment raw suit that you could have really got up. <laughs> we could be rich right now. I I forgot what it what we were talking... It was Valentine's Day or something like that. And I told him, I was like, how come you didn't give me nothing for Valentine's Day? What the fuck? And he was like, oh, Valentine's Day is technically March 14th. And I was like, what? And then... He was going to go into a room, and he came over, he's like, Valentine, he's like, March 14th is uh, steak and blowjob day. And I was like, oh, well, I gave up meat for Lent. And he was, he like, went like, Tell me that's not a fucking, we'd be rich, we would be fucking filthy rich right now if this bitch would have took that, like, holy shit, I'm fucking offended. That's a fucking lawsuit right there. (laughs) If I was if I was at a job and someone had said it at me, I'm like, bitch, you are going down and I'm rich. I know. I was like, well, I gave up meat for Lent, so sorry about your luck. <laughs> and he was like, oh. I'm telling you, this we, we, uh, we could be rich right now. You mm-hmm. fucked it all up. Good job, buddy. I thought I taught you better than that. Apparently not. <clears throat> no, but we were talking. My, my manager day. got, my manager is prego. And so my coworker, she was trying to tell everybody individually. So <clears throat> when this one particular doctor came in that day, she had gone on vacation. So my coworker, you can talk. I well, no, because I got to show the. Oh, you got to show your. You got to show your hands. Yeah. So she we she said something, and uh, my coworker was like. Mer. And he was like, "Oh, really?" And I was like, "Oh, Brittany, like I don't, I he doesn't know yet." So then he told us this joke, and he was like, if a a stork brings a white baby and a crow brings a black baby, what was it? I don't know. This is your joke. I have no idea. Um, Oh, you said... Oh, how do you... you, what, what What brings no baby? And he said, a swallow. And I laughed, but it took me a minute because I forgot that a swallow is an actual bird. A swallow is also a blowjob. That's no, what... I knew that part. I knew that part, but I was like, why does that make... That doesn't make any sense because the two other two were birds. You are sitting on so many lawsuits right now. We could be <laughs> living in a fucking castle. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, it took me a minute because I, I forgot that a swallow is a top, type of bird. When he said the swallow, I was like, oh, okay, I get that because, you know, whatever. But it took me a minute because I forgot that a you swallow was a bird. You need to have a tape bird. recorder on you so you record this shit so we can go to... <laughs> Man, we could be fucking loaded right now. <clears throat> God damn. Ed's too old to fucking understand what's happening right now. He's fucking, he's pushing 70 years old. He wears diapers. He shouldn't even be drinking beer right now. On a cold and gray Chicago morning, another little baby child is born in the ghetto. Here we go. Cheers to Nathan. You racist son of a bitch. Mark threw his... Wait, what did I throw in the trash? I didn't throw it in the garbage. I, I don't something? like meeting fathers, so I only date black women. <laughs> wow. This is a fucking... 
Uh, I have nothing to do with anything in chat to say. And Ed, yeah, 60? I don't remember the joke, but the end of it was like, "What? What doesn't bring a baby?" Yeah. So if a if a stork brings a white baby and a crow brings a black baby, what doesn't bring a baby? A swallow. A swallow. Meaning a and, blowjob mm, won't get a girl pregnant. Right. And that's what and that's what I thought of, but I was like, that doesn't make any sense because what what kind of bird? Like it's you said bird. Uh, my pure max is sitting right over here. There's tough guy. There's nothing sitting over here, sir. And right. And there it is. No, this is a water bottle. I don't want to tell the this story. Is my chat Open the stick. drawer. Grab the colorful pod system. This? God damn you. All right. I'm going to tell you guys one thing I don't like about the Pure Max. And it took me a while to figure this out. Awesome device. But this door, it's not. Uh, what, where's the door? It is the door. <laughs> Why isn't it opening right now? All right. Now it opens hard. But this door, I came down here one morning. I don't know if I was wiping this off with a rag or something, but I came down and the door was open. And all the juice that was inside it. All right, I'm fucking, I'm, I'm done vaping. I'm tired of this shit. Anyways, the door was left open. The juice leaked out everywhere. And I need to get some more pods for it. Is that time for you to go to bed? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What do you got? AIDS, for Christ's sakes? <clears throat> God damn. Sorry. <clears throat> I apologize. It's a fucking vape show. You can't cough like that. <laughs> Glenn, shut your mouth. You're an enabler. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> hey, no one coughs like that unless they smoke. Well, I smoked a lot of joints and blunts in my lo my younger years. Maybe it's, you know, catching up to me. I don't know. No, I think it might be a little bit more something. You might want to go see a doctor. <clears throat> I don't even cough like that. I can barely breathe. <coughs> this is a vape show, Ed, yes. We talk about vaping and saving lives here. <laughs> oh, speaking of saving lives, Johnny the Beard. I have a question for you. He completely... He went out and he got a charcoal grill, and he completely disowned his Blackstone grill. I have a question for you, and I I'm 100% it... serious. <clears throat> if it's personal, don't ask it while we're live. No. If, would you be okay with... Oh, no. Probably not. <laughs> nope, not a good idea. Like, if I signed up to do, like, the medical missions... What? What the fuck is that? Where you go to Don't like, say you're helping migrants, please no, God don't no, say no, that. No, 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 no. Like if I signed up and like once a year for a week I went to another no! country to no! help. <laughs> no! You ain't Oprah. <laughs> Those bitches come back with all kinds of weird diseases. What are you nuts? That's Oprah does that shit. That bitch will even leave the trailer when she goes to Africa. <laughs> okay. What do you think you are? Sorry, okay. Yeah, I'm going to Africa this week. We're going to help save, like, 500 people. Like, yeah. <clears throat> Come back with every STD under the sun. Like, Why no. would go? I'm not going there to fuck people. But it's it's a, another country. They got all kinds of shit floating around. Stay in your own country. Take care of your own people. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Why does everybody got to go to other countries to take care? Stay home and take care of your own shit. God <laughs> damn. <clears throat> <clears throat> Okay, then. <laughs> and when a cough like that, they're probably not going to let you in the country anyways. Like, oh, this bitch ain't a lot. She probably got fucking... PayPal. Sorry. Gonorrhea of <clears> the lung. <throat> <clears throat> do you, need, you need an inhaler? I think I do. Charles O'Brien, thank you so much. This... Oh, they own us, Mark Face said, LOL. Who owns who? Women. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Okay. Well, I, I, I wouldn't say they own us. I mean... They got titties and vaginas. Good it's all time they got. to incest money in Trojan condoms. You mean invest, Brian? Brian's into incest. Leave him alone. He buys the incest line of Trojans. <clears throat> Do you want an inhaler? I got one. Oh, Jesus Christ. I thought I was dying. Apparently, you're dying before me. Uh, I probably will die before you. Uh -huh. well, Just longer's... FYI. It sounds like Chicago I doesn't have, have any problems. I have life insurance. I'm like you, though. <clears throat> Chicago doesn't have any problems. I mean, <laughs> we just we shoot and kill the problem. <laughs> the incest line of are nothing but tubes. 
Were you smoking crack tonight before the show? How many white claws you have? Uh, this is my fourth one. There ain't no way that's your fourth one. <clears throat> oh, look what look uh, look what uh, Sir Johnny's drinking. He stepped up his game. He's he's not just drinking. He's drinking a big boy. What is that? Oh, he's got he's got a breakout from Puerto Rico. Mm. Look what he's drinking. Truly's, oof. No, but it's like the strong one. The, truly unruly. The unruly ooh. truly. But it's still full of like it's, sweeteners. And that's all alcohol. Sweet. Oh yeah, because sweetener is gonna be bad for you when you get <laughs> no, alcohol. No, it just tastes nasty. I think it truly tastes better than the white the white cloth. It's like <clears throat> battery acid. No, truly, it tastes nasty. The uh, the high noon one is the best tasting ones. Well, yeah, because it's got it's hard alcohol it's got sugar. with seltzer. <clears throat> you tell the dog to stop snoring for Christ's sakes. I can't even think. Roger, watch your smell of ass and balls, you nappy motherfucker, you. I tried. Lot to. Chuck gave you five dollars. Thank you, Chuck. Dear Angela and Mark. Lotto, 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 That's what he's saying. I hope you're doing a little bit faster than that, Chuck. It's like... I haven't tried the Topa Chico ones, but the the high noon ones are really good. And they got sugar in them. But I don't care about sugar because you're drinking alcohol, so... I mean, I'm not trying to, you know, like I'm. Hey, I'm healthy. I'm not drinking sugar, but I'm Angela, killing the liver. Have you tried Topo Chico seltzers? Or... I've I've seen them and I've wanted to try them, but uh, <clears throat> are they good? Well, I will try them. If you say they're good, I will try them. And I didn't know they sell cases of uh, anti-hero at Costco. Oh, do they? Yeah, I didn't know they sold oh. like ch cheap too. I mean, well, not cheap, but cheap compared to like going to the liquor store and buying. Two twelve packs. But you haven't drank anti hero in forever. I know. I've been trying everything <clears> else. <throat> this is actually really good. No, but even that brand, you don't drink anti hero, you buy their other stuff. The revolution, yeah. I like the uh hazy hero. The one that's you know, got shit floating in it. What's up, Naz uh Na I can never say your name. Angela has a very small tongue. Do I? Nesli! All right, we're not doing, uh, this ain't OnlyFans. Yeah, I can't touch my nose. It's short, I guess. All right, so let's get an update on your son. Is he going to be home? <clears throat> he said. I'm like, wow, it's not even 8 o'clock yet. Holy Jesus. This is. <sighs> he said. <clears throat> I said, what's the plan? He said, I don't know. Then going to watch my friend Carter's house after work. Could you pick me up or Uber me home? No. Yeah. Carter lives on 107th and uh, Costner. Then he can walk. <laughs> he's okay. He gets up at 10. He's got to no, be home at 11. He gets up at like 10:15. All right, so 10:15. By the time he gets to his house, it's 10:30. He's got to be home at 11, so he can spend what 15 minutes. No, tell him this right. time to come home. Um, so I, should, I just pick him up at 10 15? Yeah. Well, I don't know about you. Yeah. Rod Chuck gave you three dollars. Chuck. What sound does a chainsaw make? Vroom. Nicka, 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 nicka. Oh. Wash your smell of ass and balls, you nappy motherfucker, you. <laughs> Dirty Mike Dirty and Mike the and boys the gave you $5. <laughs> Happy Friday, Angela. Mark suck a fat dick. <laughs> Thank you, Dirty Mike and the boys. I was thinking more, Chuck, along the lines of, what, was it a chainsaw? When you pull, it, when you pull the cord, it's like, no, actually, I'm not going to do it, but you guys are fucking racist as shit. You guys say I'm racist. I don't. Who are you texting? Marcus! <clears throat> Can you text her some when the show's not going on? No. Tomorrow's gonna be seventy something, and then Sunday is gonna be eighty. And we are well, not me. I'm gonna supervise. Angela's cleaning the gutters because she's the lightest one in the family when it comes to weight wise. So she's climbing up on the house on a ladder, and I'm, I'm not like, though. And I'm making this bitch clean the gutters because I I'm ain't doing it. I'm not climbing up on the roof because somebody just fell off a roof today who's 23 and a female and came in as a level one. I told them, I was like, I'm not doing it. Well, our gutters, are, way. our gutters are clogged. So well, they then hire somebody else to do it. No. There's all these companies that do it. I'm not climbing up on the you roof. You wanted a house? I'm you got the a house. I'm the, the only worker in this house. 
You wanted a house, you okay, got it. Okay, so you want me to fall off the roof? Man, wear good shoes. Motherfucker, you get up there and do Go it. Go on YouTube, how to clean gutters. Go ahead. Not me. I'm what too, do you mean, not you? I'm too overweight to go. You know, you can go up there. No, nope, I went on the garage. <clears throat> I barely made it off the garage. You made it off there just fine. All I'm saying is the gutters are the gutters are clogged with leaves. They need to be they need to be scooped out. And this is this is your this is your uh, moment in the spotlight right here. I don't care about the gutters being stuffed up. Well, when the do. basement floods, because the gutters are not holding the water, you'll care about them. Have profession. What? Fuck the goddamn gutter covers. <clears throat> You got a woman right here who's completely capable. They can walk and climb and everything else. She can clean the gutters. I'll stand down on the bottom and catch the leaves if she's so throwing down. So what if I fall? I'll catch you. Catch this. Bitch, you throw something at me out. You couldn't even catch that. How are you going to catch me? Um. Scoot over. If you fell Here, the, catch this. If you fell off the roof, throw it at my hands. Ah, I caught it. <laughs> so if you if you fell, I, you don't think I would actually try to break your fall? You think I'm that no. ignorant? Oh, my well, God. You would try, but you'd be like 10 feet away from me. No, I wouldn't. I'd be right under. If you don't, oh, my God, you don't trust me to the point where I, you think I would try to catch you and break your fall? That's ignorant. <laughs> he could like live in a fucking, like a 10-story high rise. There's only, what, two floors. That'll still hurt. I can still what, break 20, my back. What, 25 feet? You're going to fall? That's nothing big. Okay. Break an arm? No. <clears throat> Put uh, Marcus's uh, football cleats on. You won't fall off the... You know what? Wait, never mind. <laughs> Hippie's in chat. He does roofs. Rippy, Hippie, get over here and clean the gutters out. I'll buy you a case of beer and give you a disposable. I want my pizza. And I'll buy you pizza. He fucking goes on the roof in his sleep, for Christ's sakes. Angela, I fell and it was painful. I'm sure it is painful. This girl only fell off a roof and she shattered her elbow. Hippie does this if shit for I a living. If I fall off the roof and I break anything, no more blowjobs for you. I forgot Hippie was here. <clears throat> Hippie's going to clean the gutters. He goes on roofs. He, he does it because he's bored. <laughs> He'll go on a fucking 50-story fucking tall roof. Like, yep, I'm here. If oh, I he doesn't... fall, no more blowjobs for you, ever. Your mouth will still work. You're just, you're, everything nope. else won't work. Nope, no more. I just said no more blowjobs for you. <sighs> this is the problem with... Wash your smelling ass and balls, you nappy motherfucker, you. Exactly. Listen Six to what Pack Kid gave you $5 <laughs> towards Angela's fall harness. <laughs> you want us to get you a little harness that we could strap up to something so that way if you fall, you bungee up? Roger, shut up! Stop snoring, for Christ's sake. It's not like a fucking old dying man. It's... Listen, the gutters are clogged. So when it rains, the water pours off the side of the gutter, falls down into the gravel, and then comes down here. And there's a little bit of an issue going so on. why don't it... you put a hose in the hole of the gutter and shoot everything out? Because it doesn't work like that. Because all you're doing is just shoving the leaves down into the gutter. You gotta go. But what if it's already stuck down the tube? You gotta scoop the shit out, man. How am I gonna get it if it's stuck down the tube? Shop vac. Raw Chuck gave you three dollars. Well, you can use your bottom. hands instead of your mouth. I could send a video if you want. <laughs> send us a video, Chuck. <laughs> shop vac it from the bottom. You can't. How are you, you gonna shop vac it from the top? What if it's in the the middle part of the thing? When it was snowing out, I don't know if you you don't remember this because you were at work, but it was snowing out and there was water at leaking work because I'm the only one here with a job. There was water leaking into the crawl space, so I had to go up on a ladder when it was fucking oh. blizzarding out to scoop out frozen leaves out of the gutter so the water would fucking flow through the gutter. Oh, poor baby. Every neighbor probably looked at me like, what the fuck is that piece of shit doing on a ladder? He's too fat. But the ladder we bought has a pretty high weight limit. <laughs> I might exceed it, but it's still. It's one of those ladders that fold it like 90 different ways. I wouldn't trust anybody heavier than me on. <laughs> get a, that's what I said. Get a I said it gave you $3. Ed, 
Drink about 10 to 12 Marcus, more of those beers and get on the roof tonight and clean the fucking gutters. <laughs> yeah, Red's trying to fuck Mark is losing his man card by the minute. Oh, if I have to get up on the roof, I'm taking so many photos. I don't have, A, I don't have a man card. B, Ed, go fuck yourself because you're trying to kill me. <laughs> have 10 beers and go up in the roof in the middle of the night. Dude, I'd fucking, I'd die walking up the ladder. The ladder we have is, I mean, it looks cool, but it's, I wouldn't trust it high up. <clears throat> like it's you could use it to change out your a picture of your house and I'll send you a Craigslist quote. <laughs> <laughs> Craigslist quote. So twenty bucks. So you do it for twenty bucks, hippie. <laughs> <laughs> the Craigslist. The Craigslist quotes the are the best. The <laughs> like twenty dollars, a bottle of pills, some beer, <laughs> and a fucking pizza, and I'll be over. That's what a Craigslist quote is. <laughs> Like, hey, dude, I'll do it for a hundred dollars unless you got some pills laying around the house. That's what Craigslist. And you go on, you go on Facebook. You have, you do it there. You got, you're gonna have migrants cleaning, which is fine. I'll drive down to Chicago. I'm like, hey, there's a migrant down the street with her baby strapped to her back. That, hey, watch the baby. We'll pay the bitch twenty dollars. <laughs> Let her go up in the roof and clean the gutters. I don't give a Mark, fuck. Mark, you have a son. Ask him to clean the gutters. Oh yeah, good luck with that. You can't one. ask him to fucking pick up the dog poop. So that's like having fucking, uh, I don't know, who's the most. That's like asking Superman. Wait, which one's in the wheelchair? Is it Superman? Stop it. Oh, too soon. Sorry. <laughs> That's like asking, did you fart? No. That's like asking Dylan to go up, up and clean the gutters. You might as well just tear the gutters off the house. I would house. send Marcus up there. He'd heal quicker. I'll right? You, I'm, I'm almost 40 and my knee hurts. No, uh, I got I got bad knees, bad back, bad. I got bad everything. I want some head then. That's fine. Or we can get a migrant to do it for 20 bucks. Nope. You're going to give some, some right. hour-long head. Whoa. I don't know about an hour long. It's, well, that's it's a lot gonna, of neck muscle. as long as it's going to take. What's up, NorCal? <laughs> All I'm saying is you want a house, you got it. Now you got to do house things. I could pay somebody to do the gutters. They're gutters, for Christ's sakes. If you can't clean your own gutters, you probably should have a house. Hi, Richard. Richard, a.k.a. Dick, what's going on? Thank you, sir, for that donation. And you want to clean some gutters for two bucks? I'll send a titty photo. <laughs> a titty photo for bucks. cleaning gutters? I will. Who wants to clean gutters for a titty shot? That's a pretty fucking... <laughs> you got to be pretty desperate. And I'll that. lay down so you get it this way. So they're, uh, like, that's perfect. Not... <laughs> no, when girls lay down, they're not better. It's when they, when no, they hunch you, over. you go like this. Yeah, no. It doesn't work like that. <laughs> And Richard's got gas. Richard Kellums donated two dollars. <laughs> hey Angela. Hey Angela, what? <laughs> Roger, shut the fuck up! Stop storing for Christ's sakes! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Can y'all get your minds out the fucking gutters already? <laughs> I prefer your mind to be in the gutter, James, so you can clean it. <clears throat> yeah, anybody that wants to come clean the gutters, you'll <laughs> I'll give you a titty shot laying down like this. I'll give you a, I'll give no you a, face, just titty. I'll give you a better titty <laughs> shot because I got some nice fucking does, fat firm some... ones. <laughs> what are you are, saying? I'm just saying these are fat and firm. Oh, that's my what's over there? That's well, my... mine can hit you in the face. Well, I can. <clears throat> Yours can't. I can slap. Well, they're too firm. Swap a vape mod for gutter cleaning. Sold. First one to come over here can have any vape mod they want. Hell, you could have fucking three vape. I don't want to clean the fucking gutters. I'm going to end up you'd falling. you surprised how many of the other hundred people not in chat watching would pay to see your movies. They're not that impressive, but if you're going to come clean my gutters, I will give you... I'll do it for... I'll do it right in front of you. You don't even need a picture. I'll just be like, bloop. See, that's why women... That's why I'd love to be a woman, because you ain't got to pay for shit clean anymore. Clean the gutters, and I will flash you. I'll motorboat you. Fuck it. I, Come clean the gutters and I will motorboat you. <laughs> I'm desperate, but I'd never be that desperate to clean someone's gutters for a motorboating. Like, <laughs> Mark's you... got a juggalette. I'm just saying, I clean the gutters and I will motorboat you. That's that's pretty white trashish. <clears throat> white trashish. I don't want to go up on the roof, so come clean my gutters and I will motorboat. You don't you. have to go up on the roof. You could just put the ladder up against the gutter and just. But scoop. then you gotta scoop. 
Come down. Move no, it over. Scoop, scoop and throw it over. Down. And then I'll come be on down. the bottom picking up all the shit. But you shit. still got to move it over. Grab some more. Like, you have to keep... It's not... I, I don't have 20-foot arms. So what do you think? Buying a house was maintenance-free? It's like an apartment building. It's like I wasn't condo. trying to go up on the roof. That was your job, bitch. That is, that, you ain't married to a man. <laughs> You're married to a Richard bitch. Richard Kellams donated two dollars. And Mark. Thank you, Rich, aka Dick, you son of a bitch, leaving me in last. Do I get a place to stay in dinner? Sure. What? No, you ain't sleeping nowhere and getting dinner. It's, they're gutters, <laughs> motherfucker. You're not repainting the house. Like, you have to get up on the roof so you can just grab it and go. Like, if you're on the ladder and you're just scooping, then you gotta come down, move it over, go back up. Scoop it out, come down, move it over, go back up. Then we I have seen... the fence. So you got to go around the fence, scoop it over, scoop it over, get down, come back up. Go all the way around it. What am I supposed to do when it comes to this side of the house? Oh, my God. I seen the J-hook sprayer that you're talking about, uh, ring cutter. The problem is we live by a, we live Richard under a bunch Kellum's of trees. Richard Kellum's donated $5. Happy Friday, everyone. Happy Friday, Dick, a.k.a. Richard. Thank you, sir. <laughs> We live under a bunch of big ass trees, so our gutters are filled with fucking leaves. How right many now. gutters? So it's like one, two, there's three. Two, no, there's two stories of gutters. And then yeah, and then top one, two, three. The gay goo gay gobbler. gobbler gave you three dollars. <laughs> See, Mon Mark, wear that skinny bikini and clean the gutters. Then when you're done, you can clean Angela and give her the paint the fence technique. Who do you think I am? A uh, a man? What's wrong with you? Get a piece of foam so you don't fall. I hate everybody. Actually, it would be kind of funny if I went up. <laughs> what if I went up on the roof in a two-piece bathing suit to clean the gutters out? That might go viral. Mark's diabetes and his ankles went a lot. Gonna... <laughs> I see a piece of shit. <laughs> is that a? Is that, that guy got diabetes on the on the roof? He's gonna fall, dude. I, when I went in the, on the garage to put up the basketball hoop, I thought I was gonna die. I didn't know how to get off the roof once I got the up. The man gave you two dollars. <throat> kitty, 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 kitty. Meow. <clears throat> Thank you, C man. Uh, whoa, Rich is getting. Hit. Rich is a fucking son of a bitch. I'll wait. I'll wait for that to play Brett out, Richard. Brett said, "Vents." <laughs> Actually, vents. vents would work on the gutters. You can put vents all across the gutters, and the leaves won't fall into the Who vent. Who wants a motorboat? Come do my gutters. <sighs> Jesus Christ. And you guys wonder why, you know, you wonder why I started drinking. Like, why do you start drinking beer? Well, it probably makes sense. Listen, I'm the sole breadwinner of the house. Why should I go on the fucking roof? You don't have to get on the roof. Just along the edge of the gutter. How are we going to get on the top part, though? Fuck the top part. We'll, we'll call right, Hippie. You say that until Hippie can fly him with a helicopter. He can do the, <laughs> the top, top part. But the lower part is the part that's clogged the most. Have truck I'm just come doing do that one section. You got to do all around the fucking house. You just can't do a section. What is a motorboat? Should I No, Glenn's just trying to get... <laughs> Glenn knows exactly what a motorboat is. Don't play... Are you that blonde that you're gonna like play into? No, that? I was just gonna put your head in my chest. No, this ain't OnlyFans. <laughs> you don't want a motorboat? Unless someone's cleaning my gutters. <laughs> I gotta take a piss. We need to get a bathroom down here or a bucket or some shit. You got a sink right over there. When I pee in the sink, it smells down there. It makes the laundry room smell. You pee into the hole that's over there. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Gary Goo Gay Goo Gobbler JR gave you $3. Motorboating Angela would be fine. However, motorboating Mark is the stuff of legends. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. I completely agree on that one. He can't even push his titties together to like, you know. Uh, I can, first of all, but I'm not but going to. I dated a girl once in high school that had titties like me. <laughs> They were firm, kind of torpe torpedo-ish. Oh, my armpit hurts. What did I miss, son of a bitch? Well, Trekkin, you're late. Richard you Kellams donated twenty dollars to shut Mark up. Richard, you shut your mouth.
Are you done? Are you done? Nope. Just started. Oh, and by the way, there ain't no way I'm go So she thinks it, it, it someone else clear me up. Rifleman's here. He can he's a doctor. He can explain this. She thinks that as long as I tomorrow I have to go for blood work because our is our like what is it three month six month blood work annual thing yearly. She it's says eight that hours. as long as I stop drinking by midnight, I can no. still go for blood work. I said eleven. No, you don't. You don't drink the night before and then go for blood work the next so day. So when are we supposed to get our blood work Your done? Your gutter guy gave you three dollars. I will be over tomorrow to clean the gutters, you lazy son of a bitch. Are you going to go a whole Thank day? Thank you, gutter guy. Are you going to go a whole day with no eating, no drinking, just water? No, I don't drink during so the week. So that I could go during, so we can go get our blood work during the week? You're going to yeah. go eight hours with no eating, no drinking? You don't, you, I, I'm, I don't care about the eating part. Is the, I'm not going to go hung over to a fucking blood bank to, to get my blood drawn. It's not a blood, first of all, it's not a blood all bank. All right, well, whatever it's called. It's a lab. A lab. It says eight hours and For food and liquid, not alcohol. I'm not going to go under, the doctor's going to see my blood, like, holy shit, you're dying. <laughs> like, no, I was drinking the night before. No, nope, you're Drink actually dying. pickle juice then. When are we going to get our blood work done then? I, I don't know. During the week? Yeah, I go during the week get the blood work done. Well, then fucking Uber yourself to the lab and I'll go before work. Can't you just take my blood at the house? No. And drop it off? I can go get my blood work done before I go to work, which is fine. But how are you going to go? I want to hear from Rifleman. Can I get blood work done if I stop drinking at midnight? That's, I want to know. I'm 11 gonna, is he, what I told him. Oh, he's my doctor. If he says no, I'm not doing it. If he says yes, I'm doing it. Not listening to nobody else in chat. You'd know you'd really fuck up, fuck them up if you went for blood work and shit in the cup. We don't have to pee. It's literally just blood work. Six, 12, or 24 hours food and drink, including alcohol. Well, 12 hours. Okay. 12 hours, no alcohol. So stop at fucking 11 and you're fine. Oh, no, that's that's eight hours. Never mind. <laughs> well, it's between six and eight. Six and twelve. Well, six and eight is already gone. No. Six what? and eight would be at eleven. Where the hell is Westervelt, Illinois? It sounds like a really fucking... Is it all corn out there? Where's uh, Wait, is trucking in Illinois? Trucking My wife that. says yes, you can. Wait, who said that? Wait, wait. Hold on, where's trucking <laughs> Go at? down. Where are you at? Oh, he's Beloit, Illinois. Ugh. Where the fuck is that at? Where's Beloit at? Trucking, I thought you were coming down here. Hey, Let's Sue go. Sue says my wife says you can. Yeah, well, obviously you can, but and is she it? she works in the medical field, he says. Who said that? Hey, Zeus. Hey, Zeus. I know you can, but is it? I work in the medical field, too. Is it recommended to drink the night before and then go get blood work? It sounds like a bad idea. We're just checking your cholesterol. No, there's like ten other things they check. That's not. The fuck they when I go there, she's like, okay, this is good, this is good, this is bad, that's good, this is good, that's bad. Your cholesterol, your glucose, so your sugars. And beer has sugar, so it's going to make my sugar like But not if shit. you're fasting. I'm not fasting because I'm drinking tons no, of alcohol. No, because you have to fast for eight hours. Your appointment is at 8 a.m. So if you stop drinking at 11... And you go at 8 a.m., you're probably not going to be seen and taken back until 8.30. Mr. Fagan, this shows you're a diabetic, an alcoholic, and a racist count. Wait, high racism count. Wait, what? I thought you called me a cunt. I'm not an alcoholic, I'm not racist, and I'm not a, uh, what's the other one? A high racist count. Give Marcus a disposable... Actually, that's not a bad... Let's have Marcus take my blood. The length of fast depends on... It's just the the only fasting that we have to do is for the cholesterol panel, which is eight hours of no food. Food. So I could do they drugs and alcohol? Want... Yes, because there's not counting on any of that. Oh, you're in the Illinois-Wisconsin state line, so you're like, what, two hours away? Hour and a half away? Well, trucking keep going south. No, go... Uh, actually, south is where we live. Come on south, trucking. Let's go. Let's party. We'll go to the bar. Uh, and you can take my blood work in the morning. Who are you texting now? Marcus! Now what does he want? Dad, can I get $100 for, for he lunch? He said, Jimmy's picking me up from work and going to take me home. And I said, you need to be in this house at 11. Oh, Jesus. When Jimmy's in... 
Is my phone ringing? Who's calling? Your oh, mom. My. Oh, oh no. no. Quiet. Hello? Are you done with your show? No, I'm still doing my show. Why? Why? All right. All right. All right, bye. You've got the right stuff, baby. I gotta take a fucking piss. It was nothing special. Anyways. All right, where are we at? There we go. I had to fast for 12 hours for my A1C. It's just the lipid panel that we have to fast for. A1C, Beachfront Avenue. <laughs> so your cholesterol levels, that's all you got to fast for. But, but, don't, but isn't it like liver enzymes and all kinds of other shit on that blood work? But you don't have to fast for those. It doesn't matter if you're you don't have to fast for them. But when you got alcohol flowing through your liver the entire night, I don't think your liver is probably in tip top shape. No, but if your liver was having an issue, it would be high regardless of if you were drinking the night before or if you weren't. My liver probably has issues when I'm drinking. You know what? Never mind. I'll cancel it. You can get it done whenever you want. And I'll get mine done while I'm. Do you work. live near Elk Grove Village? I don't. I don't think we do. Like no, bit. no. I guess like an hour no, away, no. maybe? Yeah. I'll just get mine done when I go to work, and you can do yours whenever the fuck you want to then. Can I do it on a Sunday? Nope. Or not open on Sunday? Nope. Why can't I just take it and just drop it off there? Who's? Are you going to let me draw your blood? Yeah, and then just drop it off there. Fucking no. Can I go during the week? You sure can. How are you going to get yourself there? Um, you going to walk? Nope. Then? You going to Uber? Yep. Then Uber. I don't know if I got a pee or shit right now. Liver damage is cumulative. That's what I'm saying. Like, it doesn't matter what you did the night before if your liver's. So got you're issues. telling me if you take a person who's just normal, who's just drinking water, whatever, he goes for blood work, and then you take a guy who's been drinking all night long up until 11 o'clock. And he gets blood work done, and as long as they both are healthy, their shit's gonna come back normal. Both of them. For I don't the believe the liver that. enzymes. Yes. Not the liver. I'm just saying the blood work in general. <clears throat> there's no way. All that alcohol flow through your body the night before. There's no way your blood work is gonna come back completely normal. I have Angela draw your blood on the show tonight. I don't have the stuff to do that. <laughs> I have to get that stuff and then do that. I don't have it. I'm just saying. You're not normal. I know I'm not normal. He won't believe me. Even I mean, I've been doing this for 15 and a half years. 15. But it doesn't... He, I know nothing. So. I know nothing either. Dylan, I'm not going to marry you because I'm on house arrest. Wait, I wish I was on house arrest. At least I could have something to talk about. <laughs> Like, why are you at house arrest? I don't know. I sodomized a bunch of migrants, and <laughs> it's only a lipid pan. What's a lipid panel test? Break it down. Alcoholics get blood work done all the time. That's what I'm saying. Mark. Oh, do they? I mean, alcoholics in chat, they get blood work done. What about, wait, My I'm mom not... got blood work done all the time. That doesn't really prove much. She, they never knew. Like, she was, you know what? Do get your blood work done whenever you want to. Are get your you blood certified work done. in phlebotomy or flip, 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 whatever? I'll get my blood work done during the week and you get yours done. Rifle man is asking done. you a question. Are you certified? I'm not certified, no, because I didn't take the test. But you used to do blood draws on the. When I worked in the uh, Obigani office, I did blood work a hundred times a day. I haven't done it now in nine years, but. Is there another one of those beers? I hope so. Oh, I must have bought a four pack of them. Yes. There's another one. These are delicious. You guys are a bunch of drunk and alcoholics. Are you donating blood? No, we're just going for like routine labs. Donating blood? What are you, nuts? Who the hell is going to fucking. <clears throat> I'm better off donating semen than I am blood. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I trust Angela Whitney. Oh, we got a, we got a dripper. We got a dripper. 
Visit your mom says, I trust Angela with needles. She handles Mark's pecker. <laughs> this is coming from a Canadian that drinks White Claw. You can't say anything he says with with any kind of anything. Bloop. Come rag. Bloop. <laughs> I'm going to fucking punch you in the face. That's your dirty ass, nasty ass finger. I don't know what the fuck they probably wiping your ass all day long. Oh, I took a shower. Oh, people want to take And I've sh- washed my hands several times. Do you wash your hands when you're done with your shower? Nope, because yeah. I do. Because you know the last part of your shower is when you rinse out your butthole and there's probably shit no, still on your I nail. No, but Mar- I put uh, Roger's cream on his eye and I wash my hands. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Roger's got eye cream, for Christ's sakes. We're, we're, White Claw makes me funny, you piece of shit. <laughs> Makes you funny looking. That's why I drink it. It makes me funny. White Claw is a... Uh, White Claw is an, an enabler. Mark should get Angela a tattoo for her birthday. Yeah, no. That's... There's no birthday presents. We don't do birthdays anymore. This is Odile. Yes, we're drinking Odile tonight, Brett. It's only got 0.01% alcohol in this. So you need at least two cases to get you a slight buzz. Uh, uh. Daily poop report. Uh, Glenn, I I gave my poop report and I said I pooed. Was it solid or loose? Very loose. Oh, uh. Thanks to the Linzess. So Lin <laughs> Linzess doesn't make you it doesn't make you shit, but it also makes you shit loosely. Mm-hmm. Why? Uh, I don't know. But so every morning it's like I don't. Don't need. I don't need details. Thank you. It's like a fire hose. <laughs> okay. Kill me. Now. Please kill me. Chris Maddie, kill me. Chris Maddie gave you three dollars. Angela, give Mark an ultimatum: clean the gutters or the beer and fridge get tossed, and it goes. The illegals currently being housed in the high schools. <laughs> Doesn't give a fuck about that fridge. I'll use the fridge upstairs. It's colder than this one. Yeah, he doesn't give a That's fuck. not a threat. That's not a threat. They don't threaten me with migraines. I'll bring them in the house. They could all, I'll have all female. Ah, this whole house loaded <laughs> up with female migrants. We like nine of them living here. I have one bathing me, one washing me, one wiping me, one cooking, like one cleaning. Don't I don't th- think you'd like the food that they cook. I'll teach you how to cook hot dogs. It ain't that hard. Speaking of hot dogs, isn't it, isn't it dinner time? Mm-hmm. Day 28. Day 28. 8-28. What's 8-20? Oh, we're 28 minutes in. Well, folks, we're 28 minutes in, which means it's time to shut this shit down. I didn't say I was going to hang out on Zoom, but I might hang out on Zoom tonight. I'm hanging out in Zoom and have a few more beers. You said you weren't hanging out in Zoom tonight. So I thought I was going to go to bed at a reasonable time. But <laughs> when the, once the beer starts flowing, that's it. Party's over. Yeah, I'm going in Zoom. <laughs> I got to take a piss first though, before I go in Zoom. I'm going to end up peeing my pants. My, like, my bladder hurts right now. It's like, I'm in pain. Stop, motherfucker. I'm trying to hold this shit in. <laughs> for this fucking show. Give me your Stop! Pee-pee. Give me the pee <laughs> Anyways, folks. Thank you all for hanging out tonight. Um, well, go on Zoom and I'll sit here till you get back. No, just go upstairs and cook. No, I'll hang out on Zoom till you get back. I just got to piss. Okay, so end it and then go on Zoom right, and I'll sit go. here till you get back. You better make food. I'll make food. Thank you all for hanging out tonight. And we will see you... Who wants a motorboat? Come the... do my gutter. Oh, my God. You are fucking <laughs> trashier than me. Oh, look. You missed one. Oh, hold on. We got to come back. Richard donated. Hold on. Let's wait. I got a fart. That's going to smell really bad because it came out like chocolate. Oh. Who's Batman? I'm Batman. Dude, my, <laughs> my bladder hurts so bad right now. Holy shit. How long does it take to like do it? Uh, when you do the YouTube uh, donation, it takes a good two minutes. But when you do the other donation, it takes it's instant. But we're going to wait for Richard because Richard deserves it, a.k.a. Dick. Cook that man some dino nuggets. I'm making hot dogs. I tonight. might pee my pants before this happens, but we're going to wait. We're going to wait. <laughs> oh, here comes the smell. It was so mm. thick it took a while for it to go through my shorts. 
I showered today, though, so we're, we're good. We're still live at the bar tonight. No, we're going to the we bar should, tomorrow. Scott, we should go to the bar live. You're, no. You're, come pick me up, Scott. Scott, let's go to the bar. Are you Stay, stay in Chicago. Stay in YouTube. They're saying stay in YouTube. I guess, well, I got to end this because people that watch the replay don't want to watch a 90 hour. Yeah, and then he's got to delete this. So yeah. it, he can go live on YouTube. That's fine, but. Because then I start talking shit and then blah, 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 blah. So it's going to get deleted. So he's got to end this and then go live. And then restart it. <clears throat> I went for Dick's. There we go. Thank you, Dick. Richard Kellums donated $20. Who's Batman, Mark? I'm Batman. You're not Batman. I'm Batman. The Puerto Rican Gandhi, known as Batman, is Batman. I'm Batman! I bet you need to go to bed is what you need to do. Batman needs to go to bed. Good night, everyone. Love you all. And I'm Batman! Oh, my God. You are cut off. No more drinking for you tonight. You're done. You're out. I think I might have peed my pants. You might have.